Now, with all the big stories breaking today, it, of course, would be easy to lose sight of a stock market rally. But it was the biggest weekly gain in a year. We begin with Deborah Kostrin at the New York Stock Exchange. Well, thanks a lot, Pam. And certainly, we had a lot of fireworks on Wall Street this week. What a week. Stocks were higher every day this week. And, of course, this coming before the holiday on Monday and where the markets are closed. So what we did see, our biggest weekly gain here in a couple of years, you can see the major averages, the S&P up almost 6 percent, the Nasdaq up 6 percent, and the Dow up uh, solidly at 5 percent. And all this week, it's been positive news on Greece that they are going to be averting a default. And then here on Friday, we also got confirmation that Maybe the U.S. economy isn't in such bad shape after all. We got that report that showed that manufacturing unexpectedly rose in June. Traders saying that that manufacturing report really tells us that the soft patch in the economy is most likely temporary, Pim. Now, Deborah, we've been talking about it all week, but the big winners, of course, stocks that are more closely tied to the economy, cyclical stocks. Cyclical stocks, also consumer discretionary stocks, that consumer discretionary index hitting a 52-week high today, and those kinds of stocks leading the market higher because the feeling is that maybe consumers will have more to spend on non-essential items. So we saw Coach, Starwood Hotels, Kohl's all doing well, and Darden hitting a 52-week high after boosting its quarterly dividend, even though the CEO is saying that economic growth is sluggish. And uh, Pim was talking about the cyclical stocks. We've been talking about them a lot this week because, of course, if you have ideas that maybe the economy is not in such bad shape, really helping out those stocks more closely tied to the economy. You saw Goodyear Tire, Ingersoll Rand, and Rider Systems all doing well, not only today, but for the past week. Pim, back to you. Thank you very much. Deborah Costner reporting from the New York Stock Exchange about today and the week's rally in equities.